Kia ora, Chrissy back again, and we're going to get into the next episode of The Last of Us. So last time we had the episode Endure and Survive, we met Henry and Sam. They had their horrific, tragic ending with Sam turning and Henry doing what he did. Uh, we also uh, had the storyline with uh, Kathleen and the rest of the uh, Liberators that uh, took control of Kansas City. Uh, and then they were just completely overrun with uh, the infected. Uh, we saw the bloater. We saw some very creepy, contortionist child clicker. <laughs> uh, the, the whole episode last week was just so incredibly sad. So I guess we're going to follow Joel and Ellie as they continue their search for Tommy. Um, yeah, so I don't know what the next episode is going to be about, but it is called Kin. So I'm guessing perhaps they find Tommy? Let's just watch and find out. Season 1, Episode 6, Kin. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, no, really? <laughs> oh, I did not like Ellie's scream. That is so freaking heartbreaking, that scream. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, are we doing winter? Oh! <gasps> Oh god. Oh, okay, it's an animal. <laughs> oh, these are new characters, right? I remember them I remember them from the trailer. Now my mind is going because winter we followed Ellie Emma after God. Joel. Who the hell are you? Just someone passing through. Okay. Why didn't you shoot him? The gun's all the way over there. <laughs> he didn't hurt me, by the way. Yeah, I got eyes. Got a girl with him. Can I come down? <laughs> Who's this little psycho? Never mind her. I need you to tell us where She's we are. He's got a gun pointing yeah, up, pointed on him. You must have missed all the street signs in the enormous fucking forest. Holy. <laughs> We're somewhere here. Exactly where, and your answer better be the same as your wife's. Okay. Telling the truth? Yeah. Are you telling me the truth? Yeah. Well, you found a great place to hide, I guess. I came here before you were born, Sonny. Get the hell away from everybody. I didn't want to. <laughs> I like it. What about the fireflies? We get those in the summer. Not the bugs, the people. There are firefly people? <laughs> <laughs> What's past the river? Death. We never seen who's out there, but we see the bodies they leave behind. If your brother's west of the river, he's gone. I like it. She seems so blase. <laughs> You're not going to scare us. You scared him? his brother that's why Joel Joel are you okay 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 I'm fine. no no but are you because just a reminder that if you're dead I'm fucked I'm fine okay. what was that all right uh so let's go and find Tommy and, and the fireflies I'm worried about Joel though because was that like some kind of panic attack after hearing about Tommy and what could potentially have happened to him or has he got some physical medical thing going on it's pretty let's say we find the fireflies it all works they draw my blood and put it through some of their fancy machines and make a cure okay you can do anything you want where are you going what are you doing sheep i would raise sheep they're quiet do what they're told <laughs> So, just you and a bunch of sheep. Romantic. <laughs> Ellie. Ellie. It'll work, right? I tried. Yeah. Sam. I was going to say, it's really hard. 
Want to take first watch or second? I'll do both. Dream of sheep ranches on the moon. <laughs> Still mumbling in your sleep. Oh, Ellie. I woke up early. You gotta wake me up if that happens. You can't do things like this. But I can. Cause I just did. Positive for you, okay? Wake me up next time. Yes, sir. <laughs> Aw. We're getting closer and closer. This is really pretty. I mean, look at that. <laughs> look at that. I've never touched snow before. Never seen it. I've seen it on mountains, but I've never been close to snow before. She's trying to learn to whistle. Oh my gosh. You don't know how to whistle? Does it sound like I know how to whistle? No. It's from the game. Damn. Okay. Exactly. You know Will Livingston. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that made electricity? Yeah. Tommy's around here. Don't ask me. I don't have a clue. <laughs> He's looking to try this time. Oh, fuck. Okay. It could still be... This could still be Tommy and his crew. Get behind me. We ain't looking for any trouble. We're just passing through. <laughs> you're infected, he will smell it and he will rip you up. Shit. <laughs> Good dog. Now her. Shit, the dog is good. Joel. <laughs> Fuck. What are you doing out here? Just looking for my brother. What's your name? It is Tommy's crew. Joel. Is this his missus? I forget what her name is. Wow. It's a lot bigger than in the game. Actually, come to think of it, we didn't really see down in the little town that they made. We saw it, I'm pretty sure we saw it from all up above. Tommy! <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, he looks good. <laughs> Look. What the fuck you doing here? <laughs> I came here to save you. <laughs> <laughs> How could you not tell your brother that you were like living this lifestyle, you know? <laughs> oh yeah, she's... She feels like this is the end. I mean, look at this. Shit, this looks like bloody Last of Us 2. This is fucking amazing. <laughs> Ellie, let's mind our manners. <laughs> what? <gasps> what about her manners? Is that Dana? Kids around here don't usually look or talk like you. Right. Well, maybe I'll teach them. She's angry. She knows this is going to be the end. Who's going to have our guys kill us? Well, you got to be real careful about who we let in this place. Well, you got a couple of 90 year olds shitting themselves out there. Billy. They say that you leave <laughs> dead bodies around? Those are the people who tried us. A bad reputation doesn't mean you're bad. Not always, at least. We're grateful for your hospitality and all, but it'd be nice to have a moment here maybe just for family. I see that wedding ring on your finger. Maria is family, actually. Oh, shit. Congrats. <laughs> Ellie, you're a little bitch. Congrats. <laughs> Awkward. How do you keep this place quiet? Carefully. 
Being in the middle of nowhere helps. Not advertising what we have, saying off the radio. House of worship. That's why. This place actually fucking works. Cheap. <laughs> hey, Joe, check it. <laughs> <laughs> Everything you see in our town, greenhouses, livestock, all shared. So, uh, communism. <laughs> nah, nah, I didn't like that. It is that, literally. This is the commune. We're communists. <laughs> you can put them in the empty house across the street from us? Yeah. It's a decent place. We do worse. Oh, trust me, we have been. We've been doing fine. Defensive much? Thanks for still giving a shit about me. So how's Tess? She's fine. All right. Good then. And the kid? She's the daughter of some firefly muckety muck. Trying to find her family somewhere out here. Big liar. So you know where they might be, these fireflies? Uh, they got a base down at the University of Eastern Colorado. It's uh, a week's ride south. It'll be easy for us. Seeing as how you can headshot infected from half a mile away, which is a bunch of bullshit, by the way. Yeah, I can't go. What, because your wife won't let you? Joel, she the one who kept you off the radio? Is that why you stopped messaging me back? After I ditched the fireflies, Marie and her crew found me. They didn't have to take me in, but they did. And all they ask is that I follow their rules. I'm your brother. Yeah, I'm aware. I mean, folks find out we're up here? No, I heard. Wrong people might show up. So is that what I am? Am I the wrong? Oh, boy. Months. I'm going to be a father. Mm. Marie is a few months long now. I feel like I'd be a good dad. Guess we'll find out. Guys. Just because life stopped for you doesn't mean it has to stop for me. Oh, yeah. Go grab some supplies and be out of your hair in the morning. I'm happy for you, though, Tommy. So here, it's getting him, isn't it? The news of Tommy's impending child hitting him a bit more personally than he expected. <laughs> Deep it cup. Gross. <laughs> I love that she finds it fascinating. Kevin from her side. I'm I'm sorry about your kids. It's okay. And kid, just Kevin. Sarah was Joel's daughter. She didn't know that yet. Fuck. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have said anything. No, it's okay. I guess that explains him a little. There are clearly things you don't know about Joel. Oh, like how he used to kill people? I know about that. And Tommy did it too. Are you worried about him? Tommy was following Joel. The way you are now. Well, maybe I'm smarter than Tommy. No offense. Oh, boy. <laughs> Be careful who you put your faith in. The only people who can betray us are the ones we trust. <sighs> Don't like this. What did you tell her? I was moving into the other room. She seemed to take it in stride. What is going on with you? This ride to the university, is it a suicide mission? No. You've had people go that way and come back? All of them. What is this? She's immune. I saw her get bit myself. That was months ago. Months. She's immune. From the beginning. Put it all out there. It was Marlene. She hired us to smuggle her to some fireflies. Tess got bit. She made me swear to take the kid. It was her dying wish. What the hell was I supposed to do? 
we made it as far as KC, and then, you know, she saved my life there from another kid, 14 years old, because I was too slow and too fucking deaf to hear him coming. And today I thought that dog was gonna tear her apart because it smelled something on her. And all I did was stand there. I was so afraid. Holy crap, Pedro. You want me to take her? I'm just gonna get her killed, I know it. I know it. I mean, it's why you took off on me, right? To make up for the things we did. You're younger than me, you're still strong. You said it yourself, you'll come back. You have to take her. It's the last thing I'll ever ask of you. I'll take her out at dawn. Oh, fuck. Wow, that was that was really good. Ellie. Oh no. Is this really all they had to worry about? Mm-hmm. Boys, movies, it's bizarre. Listen. Oh, I'm not. I'm not ready. For, I'm not ready for this. If you're gonna ditch me, ditch me. You'll be way better off with Tommy. He knows the area better than I do. Do you give a shit about me or not? Of course I do. Then what are you so afraid of? Oh God. I'm not here, you know. I'm not here, you know. Fuck. I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel. But I have lost people, too. You have no idea what loss is. Everybody I have cared for has either died or left me. Everybody fucking except for you! So don't it was really good. Be safe for somebody else, because the truth is, I would just be more scared. Wait for wait. Holy shit. You're right. You're not my daughter. I sure as hell ain't your dad. And I sure as hell ain't your dad. Now come down. We're going our separate ways. Fuck. Oh. Bella Ramsey, you, you fucking killed it, girl. You both did. You came here to say goodbye or something? No. I came here to steal one of these horses and go. <laughs> well, he gave you one. I don't know. It was 30 minutes ago, and I guess. Can't do it. You deserve a choice. I still think you'd be better off with Tommy. Let's go. Can I borrow that? Yeah. Because Maria took mine, you know. I already said yes, Joel. <laughs> Adios, big brother. Oh, nice. Oh, fuck. <laughs> finally teaching here. You're flinching. The target's too small. I made it bigger than I should have. Eject the cartridge. My phone just sucks. Okay. Give it. Squeeze the trigger like you love it. <laughs> Steady. Nice and slow. You gonna shoot this thing or get it pregnant? <laughs> you dick. <laughs> love it. Love it. We were called contractors. The contractor. That's pretty cool. Yeah. We were cool. <laughs> Everybody loved contractors. Nice. Aww, Ellie! So I've been thinking. Mm -hmm. I don't want a sheep ranch, actually. I mean, if the deal is I can do anything. That's the deal. When I was a kid, I wanted to be a singer. <laughs> Shut up. Why is that funny? You gotta sing something now. No. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm not gonna laugh. You're already laughing. Yeah, okay, chill. I wanna save the fucking world, man. That's the least you can do for me. Fair enough. Ready? Uh oh. Simple. There are definitely doctors here. 
There's a packing list. Something you make before moving. They just left. Maybe not all of them. Oh, oh that's right. <laughs> well, at least it ain't clickers. Yeah, no fireflies either. That's where they went. All the pins lead there. Maybe getting ahead of the Night weather. Marys. Better facilities. I don't know. Here we go. Out the back. The horse is out there, so you know they know someone's here. God! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh fuck! Okay! Oh god, that's different! Don't take it out! Oh. No, you idiot! Joe! Get on the horse! Get on the horse! Okay! Oh. No! Oh my god. Shoot him! Okay, cool. Joe? Joe? He's done. Joe, no, no, no! Shit! Joe, open your eyes. We can't fucking do this without you. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. What the fuck I'm gonna do? Joe! Oh, honey. Um, I was worried. I was getting worried there that, uh, like that whole section had been skipped only because, like I said earlier, uh, the interaction with those two people out in the woods, the husband and the wife, and uh, he he said the thing about the map. Uh, I thought they were gonna skip over the whole, and, and because it had become winter, and we first we first get into winter in the game with uh, Ali uh, playing from Ali's perspective after Joel had been injured, like right here. Uh, so I'm glad, I'm glad that I'm, I'm wrong about that. I cannot wait. So next episode is going to be about uh, Left Behind, right? Uh, so we're not going to get a resolution straight away with Joel being injured uh, and the introduction of David, which I'm guessing we're um, going to get in this part of the story and that whole how I said you know uh, in the the conversation that he had with the husband and wife about p pointing to the same place on the map in the wilds a bit disappointed that uh, I thought they had skipped over it's because in that moment when Joel does that to those two guys uh, it is a very torturous scene you know you see a very different very hard Joel uh, in that scene and it's a Joel that we haven't seen here though him snapping that neck just did <laughs> pretty much was it uh yeah that that part of me like was kind of scared of Joel because you know the way that he was torturing that, that those people and that is what made me think that they'd skipped over it with that dialogue between them but in the game this is where it comes in you know Joel is injured Ali tries to hunt some food or hunt whatever uh, she gets captured Joel wakes up and tries to find her and then he uh, uh, tortures those two guys to find out her whereabouts uh, but I'm happy because it it still leaves the, the uh, a, a, it still leaves the story my favorite storyline in the whole game or my favorite part in the whole game uh, David's part coming up uh, and I can't wait and I'm going to ball my eyes out. However, in this episode, I did it did get me right in my feelings when Joel and Ellie had their confrontation in the house about uh, her being left behind. <laughs> uh, and, you know, the dialogue lifted straight out of the game between the two of them about her, her, her not being his daughter uh, and him not being her father. And the part where she, you know, 
pushes him, you know, everyone leaves me, uh, you know, uh, everyone except fucking for you. When she did that and she pushed him like that, I instantly went to Ashley Johnson and that part in the game. And it was so similar. Uh, so proud of Bell Bella Ramsey for pulling that off. She was amazing this episode. Um, and Pedro Pascal with his scene with Tommy. Holy crap. The emotional depth that he that he pulled for that scene uh that didn't happen in the game not like that we didn't get the picture of sarah uh, unfortunately uh i mean that was a sweet moment but we did get that little flashback with the christmas tree which was just beautiful again uh i don't know her name the actress but you know she's the daughter of bandy tandy newton god she is beautiful uh i loved it I loved it. I love this episode. Oh, only got three more to go. This has been a great birthday episode. <laughs> okay, well, we're going to leave it here. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time for more of The Last of Us. See ya!